Hello and welcome to all of you all over the world. It is, of course, a fixture that needs no introduction. It is, without doubt, the ultimate game the continent has to give us, the final of Euro 2020. This competition has been one of change, one of many firsts, a new qualifying format, venues across the continent, no single host country, and I'm sure the debates about the success or otherwise of it will start as soon as the whistle has gone. Perhaps those debates already have, but one thing has never changed, and that is the fact that football keeps bringing us back for the very same reasons. These championships have again served the game well as a showcase for the best that it has to offer, perhaps helped in no small part by those changes which we have been witnessing. So let us hope it gets a fitting final. This game being played at Wembley Stadium, which is, in the eyes of so very many, the venue as far as football is historically concerned. Well, that was impressive. Match that. Well, for the players on both sides, this is their date with destiny, a chance to ensure their place in football history. It is without doubt, Peter, the greatest show we have this summer, and the fact that this is like a celebratory edition too makes it that little bit more special, doesn't it? I've certainly enjoyed it, giving us a, a fair share of just about everything we've come to expect from a competition of this magnitude, and yes, let's hope that it gets the perfect send-off. So what are we to expect in this final? Look, we can only hope for a final that will be free-flowing and end-to-end -end and, and highly entertaining, but fear of defeat can often dominate emotions, so don't be surprised if it gets nervy and tense. It's Immobile! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. and goes back, out to the right. Another corner, any better luck this time round. He's played it short. Oh, looks like he's been taken out there. Chiellini, Immobile, he's played him through, Spinazzola, Marco Verratti, Foden drives it forward, well there's a lot of movement out wide now, yeah you can certainly see that, well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or just getting a runner through the middle now. Now it's Kane. He gets past his man. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. Sure. And it's Sterling. Played into space out wide. 
hits one! Oh, that probably deserved better. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Bonucci moves it over to the other flank. Jorginho hoists it forward. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Sterling gets the better of his man. Sterling. Lorenzo Insigne. And it's played forward. Jorginho. No change to the score. Nil-nil it remains. And here's Kane. Good challenge. He just stood firm. Marco Verratti. Spinazzola. And it's Insigne. Now it's Insigne. Insigne tries to switch the play. Berardi with the delivery. And they've been caught out here. Now it's Berardi. Oh, that's a waste. Verratti, how about a shot? Promising cross. Foden. Grealish. Keeper's got good distance on that. He's found his man, could move up a gear here. He's left his man, Immobile! And he nearly went all the way. Immobile just might have got a little ahead of himself then. Maybe he had too much thinking time. Trippier. Greenish. Until half-time, and he is still goalless. Now it's Immobile. Berardi tries lifting it over. Over to the left. Now it's Insigne. What a throw in. Sterling did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Chiellini positions himself well and cuts it out. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Marco Verratti looking cross-field, changing the point of attack. And here's Immobile. Phillips. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. So now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. Half time in the final, Jim. How do you read it? Well, with it being a final, caginess is to be expected. Each obviously wants it badly, but neither wants to find themselves behind them. And that's the issue now. Interesting half, just missing goals, so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil nil. Already up and running for the second half. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. Greenish. Right through the middle. That's a ball to nobody in particular. Jordan Henderson. 
Foden. Foden plotting from out on the right-hand side. Sterling. Surely. It's one! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Has gone out. Trippier has come steaming up from the back for this. Giolini is fouled. Keeper sends it forward. Italy have it back and they can go again. Forward it goes. Relief, it just needed better contact. Sure, and it's Sterling. 60 minutes played. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Trippier deflected behind for a corner kick. Cuts it out. Immobile. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. And here's Immobile. It's broken loose. Chiesa. Oh, he's been flattened there. Now it's Sterling. That's the end of that. It all started well enough. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. It's got through to him. It's got through. It's Kane! Oh, he's managed to get it all wrong. And that is not the first time, Peter, the keeper has been left exposed by this defence. It needs a quick fix. Ball's gone out of play. Trippier is charging up on the overlap. In he flies! It's good distance on it. Here comes another cross. Giolini can get it clear. That will annoy the manager. They're making themselves too predictable here. Immobile. Lorenzo Insigne. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. He's through. Tries a shot! Yes, it's in! Could that be the start of something big? Looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Italy can. England take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Tries to get it forward quickly. Chiesa. Chi Towering header. So close to drawing level. Makes you think, Peter, they could have been doing this earlier. Still, it's encouraging. It's come 
loose. England are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. He gets past his man. Oh, it's open up my shapes to shoot! It's in! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! It is a good finish. The odds were against him, little matter. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, oh, you've got him, no, you don't. Brilliant. England get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, unsurprisingly, Peter, the opposition looked completely stunned. I'm not sure they can gather themselves. Jorginho Immobile! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Immobile certainly did his part with a lovely pass, and unfortunately, the loveliness ceased there. It's a good run down the right. Where could this lead? He's made sure that that won't get through. Lorenzo Insigne. Chiesa. Going for Chiesa! Oh, that is rather wayward. Information that there will be four minutes stoppage time. That's a decent ball. Oh, good interception. Up towards the front line. Has he found his man? Now it's Kane. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. Is that England celebrates? They are the continent's ultimate team, winners of the European Championship. So, on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment.